chanter. Hello, I'm Angela, Parisian Farm Girl, and welcome to my channel. The weather has gotten cold, and I need some new clothes. Specifically, some nice cozy sweaters, some jackets, I need a little wardrobe pick-me-up. And so I thought this would be the perfect opportunity to share with my audience one of my fashion philosophies. So let's head to the thrift store and have some fun. And then I'm going to share with you a little hint how you can keep your wardrobe classic, timeless, and affordable. Okay, Amelie and I just got back from the thrift store and it was fantastic. I would say we scored. So let's start with this whole fashion philosophy. And this is something that has suited me well for many years. I am a big thrifter. I love the thrill of the hunt. I love antiques. I love vintage items. And that's always incorporated its way into my wardrobe. I also love tailored pieces, well-made pieces, classic, timeless pieces, and I'm not afraid to make the investment when the time comes. So over the years, I've grabbed many bags. About every five years, I make an investment in a bag. Now, Teddy Blake asked me to review one of their bags. I wanted to share that with you. This is what I selected. It looks like a little Kelly bag, which I love and it's red crocodile this is going to suit me very well for probably the next five to ten years it's made in italy and that's my fashion philosophy let's call it fashion philosophy number seven buy well-made thrifted clothing save money on your clothes let someone else pay the um depreciation if you will and go ahead and every few years, every five years, every 10 years, invest in a beautiful bag, invest in a pair of shoes. This year, you saw earlier on Everyday Chateau, I treated myself to a gorgeous pair of Stuart Weissman high heels. They're nude, I'm going to wear them forever. They go with everything. I'm loving this bag, red I'm using as a neutral, so don't be afraid to step out and pick a bold color. In the past, I had this peacock color purse, I've used that almost every day for five years, and I used that teal as the neutral. In this case, I'm gonna use red as the neutral. This is a timeless shape, it's well made, it's made in Italy. There are plenty of links in the description so you can get one at a discount. And now I wanna show you some of the thrifted pieces that I found today to just give you a little inspiration when you're at the thrift shop yourself. So this, when I shop uh, for thrifted pieces, I am looking for the label. I'm looking for something very well made. This is a Dana Buckman, and it's got a fun um, kind of uh, Chanel-ish uh, gold link detail with ribbon woven through, and this will keep me plenty warm here in Wisconsin during the winter. I also found this adorable, adorable, I need a new jacket, like I need a hole in the head, Banana Republic jacket. The colors are fun, perfect for fall, perfect for winter, 99% wool, beautifully constructed, and I paid about $6 for it. So this is going to be a piece that I can incorporate into my wardrobe for a long time. And again, combine it with my red bag, even with the sweater, combine it with my bag. Don't be afraid to use color as a neutral. 
this adorable jacket type sweater. As you can tell, I'm a girl that likes a little construct. I like structure in my clothing. I think it's very flattering for women. Sometimes I think we look a little dumpy in all that cotton. Speaking of that, here's my cotton. Now, instead of going with a long sleeve t-shirt, I went with this Calvin Klein long sleeved, very thin sweater. And this is gonna suit me very well to wear under these jackets or just when I'm home with my mom jeans and my apron. Goes really great with these cream colored Calvin Klein loafers that I'm wearing. Again, your shoeing is another place where you can make an investment. It's often easy to find affordable, really nice shoeing. Shoes ruin an outfit, so always choose something tailored, something leather, to just bring your outfit up a notch, even if you're at home, moms. This is a gorgeous fuchsia gap sweater. Now sweaters are definitely an area of my wardrobe where I am deficient. So I really feel like I scored on this one. It's going to go fabulously with the purple rain lip scents that I wear when I'm not wearing my signature reds, of course. This is lush and plush and it's going to keep me plenty warm on cold Wisconsin days. And then, I found this little, just a H&M cheapy, but this can go underneath the Banana Republic jacket. So all in all, I spent $88. I got a stack of clothing, just a great, great injection into that winter wardrobe. I spent $88. I splurged on the bag from Teddy Blake. So in this whole pile, I spent what many do on just a, a few runs to Target for low quality clothing that's just gonna get worn and nubby and wear out. So my fashion philosophy is invest in good accessories. Invest in a handbag every five to 10 years. For the next five years, I've chosen my Teddy Blake. Thrift shop for really quality clothing. Don't forget to buy really good shoeing, leather. Go ahead and go with the name brands because they're gonna give you just a little bit more quality. Choose places like Ross and TJ Maxx if you're on a budget. Save money by shopping at the thrift store for your clothing. If you live in a major metropolitan area, one of my biggest hints to you would be to travel to the more affluent suburbs in that area. You will find a fabulous upscale quality inventory at those thrift shops. So seek out those upscale that higher demographic and reap the rewards. This is the new Dana Buckman sweater. I sure do love it. It's different than anything I own. I usually pick something with a little bit more structure, but I had such a need for some sweaters this winter. It goes fabulous with my bag. If you'd like to invest in a new bag this winter, I have great discounts for you in the description, so be sure to check that out. And if you would like me to make a few more videos like this, giving some more ideas on creating your own classic timeless and affordable look for your wardrobe. Would you please let me know in the comment box? In the meantime, I'm going to have fun hanging up all these clothes in my closet and enjoy my new outfits for winter. A viento. This is the new Dana Buckman sweater. I'm loving it. It's a little bit um, more laid back than I normally pick. I do like something with a bit more structure, but it sure is cozy. Oh, there's a fly attacking me. 